Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh, you hear my arm crack? Goodness. Welcome back to my channel. It's Colorful by One. So, I entered a giveaway and it was from Trinae's Harris giveaway and she's on YouTube. Oh, I don't have that wash. You like that? Yeah, so this is what I won. A little stamp collection here. Hope your birthday's a smash. And it's from Lawn Fawn. Isn't that cute? So I can't wait to play with that. And she sent a little thank you note. How cute. Love that. So thank you, Trine. So now my DIY, we're going to do a pillow and everything's from Dollar Tree. Of course. Where did you think the stuff was coming from? So I know you've seen these microfiber cloths in Dollar Tree. They are so soft. You can use these for so many things. But we're going to make a pillow. And I was going to do an Easter pillow. But I think I'm just going to call these spring pillows. So the measurements on these pillows are going to be 12 by 13, 12 by 13 and a half. I'm guessing 12 by 13 or 14. So what we're going to do is fold it in half like so. Make it really nice and we're going to put pom poms on them. And all you need is a glue gun. And I know you guys know because I've seen you guys make these pillows before. And I want to try it. Yeah, these cloths are in the automotive part. Okay. So we got our little trim here, our pom pom trim. And I've had these for a while. Just, um, they came from Walmart in the clearance section. So I got yellow and I found a pink one. So I'm going to start right up here in the corner. And I'm going to lay my pom-pom down first. right on that seam and you just go along the seam this couldn't be more easier and I know an Easter one would be really pretty but if I do Easter that means I'm going to have to put my pillows up so I want these to be out all year round since they're uh, white or off-white. They'll go with anything. And these cloths were for my husband. But as I got them home, I was like, oh no, that is a pillow. So I have to go back and get him some now. Go back and get some more. And there you have it. The first section is on. Now you just go back and put the top down. Oh, that came up because it was stuck to the paper. Let me lay that back down. It was stuck to the paper. Okay, now it's on. Okay, now all I have all I have to do is close it up. Lay the top down on the trim. And this side will be done. Oh, 
How cute is this? I do say so myself. Okay, and then you just uh, cut the trim off. So there, the first part is done. Now we're going to go along the long part, close that up, and you do it just the same way. So let me close that up and I'll be right back. Okay guys, we got two seams done, that's closed up, and the other side is closed. Now all we got to do is fill this. Now instead of going to buy that polyfill or whatever that stuff is or some foam or whatever we're gonna fill it with stuff you already got at home paper bags if you're like me you have a whole bunch of these because they fit the bathroom um garbage can really good so we're just gonna fill that up but you don't want to use these these are really hard you want to use the soft uh, plastic. So I know I keep everything. Don't judge me. I keep everything. So what you want to do is just stuff that. And I'm going to go ahead and stuff it and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. She is all filled up. She is stuffed. So let's go ahead and do the other side with the pom-poms. And you just run it along the seam. So let me get this side on and I'll be right back again. Okay guys, I am back. I filled it all with the plastic bag. And there is your pillow. Quick and easy. Love it. And you can also cinch it in the middle with a bow or something that'll be different so there you have it so let me know what you think and leave me a comment love it and thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe i will see you in another video Bye.